Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, here is your instructor Tanzeel. And in this video we will be working up with these three boxes, sorry the circle. Then we have the title, description and then the button which will take us to the page which is this featured page, featured page and then an image will also appear here. So how we will do that? In order to do, do that we have to create three pages. So we are going to go with post, sorry pages and then we have all pages and I can create a new page just let me delete this page I will click add new and I will create new page okay and this name will be about us Here I have to enter something which will be dummy content. And I can select all, copy and paste. So now I have to come here and then I have to create a featured image like here you guys can see that I can even create a new slider or I can create add that slider but I don't want to so I will set a featured image which will appear here the title will appear about the about us page the description will be this or I can add other description as well and then the image will be our featured image which will be this so I will select an image from the media library and about us about us would be this set featured image and publish now i have to create three pages like this so i will create it create them okay guys so i have created these three pages which is about us brands we deal in and then contact us you can view them if you want to but i don't have time to do that i will just come up here to the customize section and i will refresh this make sure that you guys refresh this so the page list may appear here which will be there are no pages this is a sample page so we will refresh this url so the pages list may appear here then we have to come up here to the home front page and then here first of all I'm going to select the about us then I'm going to select the brands we deal in and then I will select contact us and you will see all the images here it's taking too longer yeah now done so we have now this image contact us brands we deal in and then about us we can even add okay let me save and publish what is it doing let me refresh this page content home post front page down 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 and then we have this so I can add something like here you guys can see this is the dummy content I will use hello Tentil. and I will select this copy and paste same here same here and now save and publish so now I have to come here and refresh this now we have now we have this appearing about us 
Hello in Zeal, and when I will click this page, I will be redirected to the About Us page. Like I click there, and I'm in the About Us page. This is the widget tab. You can see left sidebar has no widgets, so I can add widgets in the widget tab. You can see this block is visible for only admin users as I'm logged in. When I will open this page in incognito window, which will be my private window. Then you guys may see that there will be no alert box. I can click here. And here is my slider. Now you guys may have noticed that this slider is very, very, very fast. It is moving very fast. I can uh, control it by coming here in the customizer going up going up going up and we have display each slider between i can increase and i will click save and publish when i will refresh the speed will be automatically delayed somehow and now you will see that this will take some time to move so so our front page section is over. Now there are pages and post layout and other stuff. You can mess around with it. They're very, very, very basic and you guys don't need any instruction for that. Then we have our footer and I can add something to our footer. You can see this, is, this block is only visible for admin users only. Display a back over to scroll. You can see this button. When I will click, I will be redirect. I will be move up to the home page. I can even uncheck this to remove and then I can add in widgets in my footer by coming up here and footer widget area 1, area 2 and area 3. Then we have advanced option where we can add some custom CSS like if I... Okay, so if you guys do know some HTML and CSS then you probably might know that we can do mess around with our theme like when I will under this, this you can see the body background color has been changed to black. Okay, so this is how it will work, the CSS, which you can apply advanced. So you guys don't need to mess around with it. Just you guys can go with these options. So thanks a lot, guys. In the next video, we will learn to build a menu for our website. And stay tuned. Goodbye.